pay Tom from every cloud accounting here. So when you're running a business, there are so many taxes to think about, aren't there? And one of those is VAT, and VAT confuses a lot of business owners. So with VAT, there's a threshold. So if you're not registered for VAT yet, when you breach this threshold, which means you go over a certain limit with HMRC, you need to register for VAT. And it's really important. I've seen business owners get fined like a whole load of money for not registering. So it's something that needs to be on your radar. So the limit, the threshold is £85,000. So that's the amount that you need to get tattooed on your arm. And when you breach that limit, you must register within 30 days, basically, after the time you went over the limit. So the limit is not the calendar year, it's not your accounting period, it's a rolling 12 months. So you need to be able to see in your accounting software how much turnover you've done in the last 12 months exactly. So, and when you go over that limit, so say you went, did it to the 31st of August, say you're over that 85,000 pound limit, you've then got 30 days after to register, so you'd have 30th of September to register, and your effective date would then be the 1st of October. So if you do breach it, you need to act quickly. A couple of other key notes are, if you think you're gonna do 85,000 pounds, suddenly in the next 30 days, you also need to register. And secondly, you can voluntary register as well. So you don't have to register when you go over the limit. If you're maybe dealing with a lot of VAT customers who are already registered, you wanna claim VAT back on some of your supplies, you could register even if you're below the limit. But that's probably a video for another time. Um, so look in your accounting software, see what um, your turnover has been in the last 12 months and it's something that needs to be on your radar. So I hope that helps and I'll speak to you soon.